you're going to be working together to do the workbook pages for uh, Inside Phonics, pages four through six. Please speak aloud, practice, watch again and again to learn the words and learn the sounds and learn the names of the letters. When we work we are working horizontally. So we are working across the page. The numbers on the page don't matter. Okay. Also, I identify by color. So I hope you know your colors. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and purple. Have fun. So here we are inside phonics, working on phonemic awareness, phonics, decoding, and spelling. We are first working with these letters and sounds. The first letter is called S. Repeat after me. S. S. It makes this sound. The next letter is called M. Repeat after me. M. M. It makes this sound in a word. M. M. The next letter is called F. Repeat after me. F. F. This is the sound F makes in a word. Repeat after me. <sighs> the next sound and letter, the next letter is called H. Repeat after me. H. H. This letter makes the sound Repeat after me. This letter is called T. Please repeat. T. T. It makes the sound T. Repeat after me. Now these five letters, S, M, F, H, and T, are called consonants. Repeat after me, consonants, consonants, S, M, F, H, T, consonants. That's good. Now the last letter we have on here is not a consonant. This is the letter A. Repeat after me. A. A. This letter can have different sounds. One of the sounds it makes is just like its name. A. Repeat after me again. A. That's called a long vowel. When it makes its says the name, says its name, the sound is called long. When it otherwise it's a short one and it makes this sound. Repeat after me. Ah. 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 Letter A is a vowel. Repeat after me. Vowel. Vowel. We have lots of consonants and one vowel here. Now let's take a look at the names of these pictures. 
the first picture here with the letter S, the picture is of a seed. The little black dots, those are seeds. Repeat after me, seed, seed. Interesting thing, in this word, we have the vowel E. And when you have two E's together, it says its name, E. The next word we have is map, map. So you might notice the shape is the United States, but the fact that it's drawn this way to show borders makes it a map. The next picture, do you know what that is? It's a fish, fish. Now an interesting thing about consonants, usually consonants make the same sound, doesn't matter where it is in the letter. But some of the consonants, when you put them together, like S and H, make a new sound. S and H in English make the sound shh. Let me hear you say shh. Shh. Repeat after me, fish, fish. Good. Next word is hand. Repeat after me. Hand. Hand. And finally, for the consonants at least, tiger. Repeat please. Tiger. Tiger. And our last word starts with a vowel. Apple. Repeat after me. Apple, apple. Now we're going to look at these pictures and we're going to name the pictures and I want you to say what letter spells the first sound you hear. So the first picture here, bordered in red, that's a sandwich, sandwich. Do you know what letter spells the first sound in sandwich? That's right, it's the letter S, sandwich. Now, as I'm saying these words, I'll wait a little bit and hopefully you will work on repeating. So say the word in yellow, sandwich. Now in orange, we have a table table. What letter spells the first sound you hear in table? That's right, letter T. Table. For the third picture here in yellow, we have a helmet. Helmet. So what letter spells the first sound you hear in helmet? That's the letter H, helmet. In the next row now, the picture circled in green. This is a fan, fan. What letter spells the first sound you hear in fan? Yep, it's the letter F, fan. The picture here in blue is a mask, mask. What letter spells the first sound you hear in mask? Mm. The letter M, mask. And finally, in the purple picture, we have an astronaut. Astronaut. This is the vowel. A for astronaut. 
Okay, let's do some more. Remember, we're going across the page and then down to the next row. What is the first letter you hear in the word hall? Hall. Yep, letter H. What is the first word you hear, sorry, the first letter you hear in the word ant? Ant. Ant. The letter A. Ant. In the yellow picture, what is the first sound you hear in the word fence? Fence. F fence. The letter F. Fence. In the green picture in the second row, what is the first, what is the letter you hear first in the word mouse? Mouse. Mm. Mouse. The letter M. In the blue picture, what is the first letter you hear in the word soap? Soap. Soap. It's the letter S. Soap. And finally, in the purple picture, we have the arrow pointing to the tape. 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 What letter makes the first sound you hear in tape? The letter T. Tape. Now we're going to look at some of these words. We've got, in the first line there, we've got S, M, F, H, T, and A. S for seed, the arrow's pointing to the seed. M for map, F for fish, H for hand, T for tiger, A for apple. Where's the apple? Oops, there we go. Yep, there's the apple. Where's the fish? F, F fish. There it is. Where's the hand? Hand, H, hand. There it is. Where's the map? Map. M. M. Map. That's right. Where is the seed? S. 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 Seed. Oops, I did that one wrong. I'll have to fix that on my slide. Well, seed is the one that's not. What is that that I just did circle or put the blue square around? That's right. T tiger. T tiger. Let's see if S shows up now. There it is. Okay. I messed up on my presentation. All right. Next row, you're going to say the name of each picture below. And then what letter spells the first sound you hear? We're going to circle the letter. So now here in number one, they already did that for you. It's a picture of a hall. They circled it. So now let's take a look at the next one, four. That's an astronaut. Astronaut. So which letter is it going to be? F, H, or A? Astronaut A. Number seven here. This is 
Do you remember the name of that picture? Tape. Tape. So is it going to be the A, the M, or the T? That's right. It's the T. So in the next ones that we do, I'm going to say the name of the picture, and then I'm going to show the answer. But I hope you'll practice by saying all of the letters, but still figure out which is the right letter. So in number two here, we have soap. Soap. And the answer is S. Number five here, we have mask. Mask. And the answer is M. In number eight, we have a mouse. Mouse. And the answer is M. In number three, we have a fence. Fence. And the answer is F. Number six, ant, ant, a, a, tiger, tiger, t, t. All right, now we're going to do something just a little different. Say the name of each picture below. What letter spells the first sound you hear? Write the letter. And I hope after this you're going to do some practice and write the words and the letters so you are adding to your vocabulary. It's important to write by hand and not just type everything you do. So in our first picture. It was S for seed. Okay, next one over. Map. Map. What's the first letter? M. M. Next one in the row. What is that picture? Ant. Ant. And what letter spells the first sound you hear? A. T for 10. And the next one we have helmet. Helmet. And that is the letter H. And finally we have astronaut astronaut and that's another a okay so in the first row across we have in number three hand hand so what's the first letter h h in number eight we have tape tape. And the first letter is T. In number 13, we have mouse. Mouse. And the first letter, M. M. And now down to the next row. In number four, we have sandwich. Sandwich. S, S. In number nine, we have fish, fish, F, F. Number 14, we have fan, fan, F again, F. And in the bottom, we have apple, apple, A, 
A. Number 10, we have fence. Fence. F. F. And our last one, we have the number six. Six. And that's the letter S. And that brings us to the end of our Inside Phonics. Thank you for working. Practice your writing and your reading. Until next time. Bye.